The early start to the deadly 2020 tornado season ranks seventh on our list of top 10 weather events of 2020. Traditionally, many people think of severe weather season as starting in March and happening mostly in the Plains states. However, the 2020 season started early in the deep south and southeast. More than 80 tornadoes were confirmed during a deadly two-day outbreak in January, which caused 10 deaths. By the end of April, 460 tornadoes have been confirmed nationwide, most of those concentrated throughout the southeast. But the most sobering statistics are in the tornado death count. By the end of April, the U.S. had already surpassed the full year average of 71 people killed by tornadoes. Three tornado events in March and April led to 63 deaths across the U.S. The Middle Tennessee nighttime tornadoes, including a powerful one that ripped through downtown Nashville. The Easter Sunday outbreak across the southeast, killing 35 people and causing $3.6 billion in damage. And less than 10 days later, another round of strong tornadoes across southeast Mississippi. What was behind this busy tornado season? An active subtropical jet stream repeatedly brought in energy and wind shear to the upper levels of the atmosphere. The other component is very warm, humid air in place. Unusually warm Gulf of Mexico water temperatures pumped plenty of heat into the southeast, adding moisture and instability. In total, more than 80 people were killed during the 2020 severe weather season. 10 of the severe weather and tornado events from January through May caused over a billion dollars of damage each. You can find out more about the early start to the deadly 2020 severe weather season on our website, weathernationtv.com, as well as the full list of our top 10 weather events of 2020. For Weather Nation, I'm meteorologist Kara James.